So early reactions to X-Men 97 have hit social media and generally the sentiment appears to be positive. Now, as is the case with most of these things, a handful of critics will have early access to a sample size of a TV series. I think in this case, it was like three episodes. And then they take to X Twitter to give their hot take of generally what they thought of what they watched. Now, generally, the sentiment seems to be very enjoyable as well as faithful to the original, which in my opinion is very hopeful for me. I don't typically put a lot of stock in these early reactions, A, because I don't know the relationship that these critics have with Disney. And also it's very hard to tell an entire series based off of three episodes but generally i find this to be good news just because it's a cartoon i mean it's based off a children's cartoon in the 90s and i don't think anyone here was expecting shakespeare from x-men 97 i think we all just want it to be faithful to the original for it to appear like it was when we were kids and also be enjoyable it seems from all these reactions like it's hitting all those notes so i have an article here from screen rant it says marvel's x-men 97 first social media reaction are here. It says X-Men 97 is a nostalgic hit capturing the essence of the original animated series with modern updates and creative storytelling. Fans are in for a treat with the revival which includes a mix of classic X-Men characters and exciting new storylines. Social media reactions praise the show's homage to the 90s series, high quality animation, and faithfulness to the beloved mutants. So let's check out some of these reactions from the critics that got early access. Mama's Geeky's Tessa Smith shared how they were overwhelmed to have the show back, celebrating so many characters and storylines done perfectly. POC Culture praised X-Men 97's first three episodes for handling the nostalgia perfectly, including the use of action and powers, as well as being pleasantly hilarious and surprisingly sexy. Eric Goldman commented how X-Men 97 takes the original series and updates it with modern animation, great action sequences, and an anime influence. The directs Russ Milham can confidently say that fans of the original X-Men animated series will be thrilled with X-Men 97 as a sequel and there's also a few more reactions that also pretty much say the same thing so i definitely think it's a great sign that just judging by the first three episodes that they are very faithful to the original i think that that's at the end of the day what most of us who grew up with this cartoon want we don't want to see something that feels like it's born of 2024 obviously they're going to make updates i mean animation has gotten leaps and bounds better in two decades but still you know i think we wanted to have that feeling like we're kids again and we're watching a continuation to the series that we enjoy. So my opinion, I'm definitely happy to see these reactions. I mean, even when you look back to the early reactions to Echo, I kind of noticed that a lot of the critics kind of danced around a few things. They said that they thought it was really gritty, but that the show overall had issues within the story. I don't really see the same thing with this. It seems like generally people are enjoying it and there isn't really any kind of like backdoor criticisms about the show. I mean, obviously three episodes doesn't tell the entire higher story, but I'm more inclined to think that three episodes is a little bit more impactful when it comes to this kind of medium. I mean, it's like I said, a revival of a children's cartoon from the nineties. All I want is for it to maintain its grittiness, its edginess, because you know, nowadays children's cartoons are way different. I mean, my nephew watches, I think it's called Spider-Man and his amazing friends. And I don't even think they throw a punch in that cartoon. Not to act like X-Men 97 is an R rated property. It hundred percent is not, but compared to what kids watch these days, well, it's a whole new world. So I'm happy that generally the people that got early access enjoyed what they saw. And I will say I have been enjoying what I've been seeing myself. I've seen some clips. I've seen some trailers. I even reacted to a few on my channel if you want to check them out after this. And overall, it does appear to be faithful to me. But anyways, I'm going to throw it to you in the comments. Let me know what you think of these early reactions. Does it make you more excited? Does it not really move the needle for you? Leave a like on this video if you found it enjoyable. Also consider subscribing if you enjoy the content that I cover on my channel. And as always, my name's Eric Rose and I hope you all have a fantastic day.